What up, what up, everybody? It's your boy, A.D., in the spot all day. Here for y'all, man. Finna talk about some real stuff, man. Like I always do, you feel me? I'm in here chilling. I got my cup, you feel me? In here, man. Man, man, oh, man. Finna talk about real subject, real issue right now, man. Just in here chilling, man. It's been a minute since I made a video where I'm actually in here with a cup. You look at a lot of my uh, my older Real Talk videos, I used to just be in here, man, turning up with my liquor, turning up, making videos, so I'm going to do it for this one. So, cheers out here to y'all, man. But, alright, let's get into it, though, right? So, this video, man, is basically about, man, something that I really find to be true, which really proves to me that majority of people do not care about people in, in the general. Because something I've been noticing that is so true to me, I don't know why people feel like just because someone has a job, they automatically will appreciate that person and automatically assume that person is doing good and doing great. Now, I, now, I don't want nobody coming at me being like, oh, well, what do you mean? Isn't a job a good thing? Well, having a job is okay to a certain extent, but you need to understand why we have jobs and you need to understand who gets what and what gets happens. It's hard to think that getting a job is always good when you don't even really understand why the jobs are even in here in the first place. What, because we're so-called making the country a better place? No. The thing that irks me, though, is how people do not pay attention who that person will be and how they won't even pay attention to how much money they spend and what they do with their money. It's like people will congratulate a person who has a job just because they got a job. I swear, it could be anyone. And it could be somebody who's bummy acting as hell. And they'll think, oh, well, this person got a job, though. They doing something. And it really annoys me because, to be honest with y'all, a lot of these people out here with jobs ain't doing shit. To be honest with y'all, a lot of these jobs out here ain't really good at all. Shit, majority of jobs out here are not good paying jobs. So let's be real about that. You know what I'm saying? So having a job, it's like now, especially in 2017, it's like nowadays, not only do you have to have a job, you got to have something else or you need something else. Like, in my honest opinion, I feel like a business beats a job any time of the day. Especially if you know how to save your money and to invest. Because a job is just something that you slave for. A job is just something that you're going to keep coming back slaving, getting your checks, spending your money. Because you see, most people spend what they make. Ain't nobody really saving no money around here and shit. That's why I get upset when people be claiming they got a job. Or, or they might spend more than what they really have just to try to show out. Because one thing I realized in this world is that a lot of people don't really care about people no more. People only care about keeping up with the Joneses. People care more about keeping up with the Joneses than who people are as actual people. I've seen people literally help people that ain't shit just because they got a job or they acting fake than someone who doesn't have a job but who who's trying their best and who's very smart and educated. I've seen people not even give a fuck about them. Because they ain't all flashy and all stupid. It's like people will respect you ten times more nowadays. Even though in my honest opinion, they really don't respect you. It's like when people try to act like they cool with you nowadays, they don't really be cool with you. They just be trying to pretend to be cool with you just so they can get shit out of you. Or they can get attention from you. Because, you know, people love people who got more than them. You know, people love that shit. But people who got less than them, they talk shit about and act like they better than them. That is a huge, huge problem to me. That is a huge, huge problem. Because that means you it's so much shit you're going to miss out on life. You know, people are so crazy, right? Let me tell you. This, this is real. People are so brain gone. It could be anybody. It could be a celebrity. Let's say a celebrity was out here that they know is rich and balling. And they love, you know, they love the hell out of that celebrity. They'll be all on their nuts. They'll be, oh, I love you. You know, I'll go to your concerts. I'll do, and do this and that, even though they'll never do it back for them. But they'll do it anyways, because like I said, people are attached to what other people got. Like I said, people don't really give a fuck about you. They only care about what you got. And 
the reason why I bring up this story is if I bet you if there was a big story that said, oh, this celebrity is broke, this celebrity is now homeless out on the street, I bet you that person who so-called loved them and was a big fan of them would not even try to help them or be their fan no more. And it's so crazy, it can happen in a day. Like, I'm not even lying to you, because people be so phony, that's why you don't need to fall for that phony shit. It's so easy to see what people be scheming and black. It's like, come on, man. Obviously, you, you, you know what I'm saying? Obviously, you just liked them because they had money and they were in your face and they were being flashy and you thought they had a job and had some money and you thought they was doing something. But once they lose it, you don't care about them no more. You like, damn. Most people probably in that situation to be like, damn, that's fucked up. And then probably just keep it moving and find somebody else to go worship and go nut ride. That's what most people do. And the, but the fucked up part about that is eventually you run out of options, just like the people you know in your life. Because eventually you do run out of options, and it's, it's messed up, man. That's why I get so irritated about that. Like, I, I just don't understand why people do that. Like, pay attention to who the person is. It's not who cares about where they work and this and that. Because the main ones that be in your face quick to say, oh, I got a job, I'm working, doing this and that, let them lose it. They'd be the main ones disappearing and you won't even hear from or see them. They'd be the main ones who ain't even, won't even tell you that they lost the job. They'd be the main ones. Shit, if I lose a job, fuck it. I'm just gonna tell you, shit. Fuck it. You know what I'm saying? You gonna find out anyways. So why I sit here and lie? Or why not? tell nobody why I try to wait till somebody find out the last second why you gonna know anyways so that's why I'm just keeping it real man that stuff is like check yourself for you wreck yourself out here man you out here sweating motherfuckers over jobs and fake fucking cars that they can't afford you better wake the hell up man you better wake the fuck up you around here thinking fake people is your friend, but once your ass broke, them fake motherfuckers is gone. Or once they ass broke, they leeching off your ass to somebody else. You better wake up. You better, better recognize who real and who not out here, man. I mean, I've seen it in my life. I've seen people who, I mean, it's even happened to myself. You know, it was a point in time where I was working, hustling, and working. Thought I was never going to be broke, right? Hmm. Yeah, I found that out the hard way, and I, I learned that the hard way in my life because I was I, I was somewhat being smart, but I didn't have it all figured out. I didn't realize what was really important in my life, and that's what helped me become the person I am today, to realize, like, yeah, man, when you got something, you better fucking appreciate that shit, and you better fucking, whoever you mess with, it better be somebody that you know close and somebody who will do it back for you. Don't be fucking around with them fucking rounds. It's only with you because of what you got. I'm telling you, don't do it. Pay, just pay attention to how people act. People will tell you exactly how they think. A person doesn't have to tell you how they think. Just pay attention to how they act. There you go. It's that simple. Because people who think certain ways don't do certain shit. Right? <laughs> Like, you won't see me doing no crazy, dumbass shit because it's like, hey, I think that shit is stupid and it ain't helping. You know? That's basically what I'm trying to say. And just don't be no fucking... And stop worshipping these people that's going to these jobs like that. Like, it's too many people out here that's working but don't understand the job system is set up for them to fail. Especially a lot of black folks, man. And I ain't trying to talk down about black people. I love my black folks, man. It's just... But more y'all need to wake up and understand that because it's too many of y'all and i know it ain't just black people just everybody's doing it but it's really messed up for black people to be doing it because it's hard for us to get a job and really get a high rank position in period it's a lot of people won't hire us just because they know we black i'm just being honest you know what i'm saying that's why it's really foolish for a black person to be out here oh i got a job i'm standing in front of because you know you don't own the bitch it's common sense Motherfuckers need to be out here trying to, instead of flexing that job, motherfuckers need to be out here flexing that other shit. And like I said, I know it ain't just black people. I know damn well it's everybody, you know. But people have it better. Certain people got it better. So they can, even though it's not good for anyone to bullshit like what I'm saying. 
But motherfuckers got to get in, in, in order, man. For real, man. Fuck these damn jobs. Get your motherfucking hustle on. These jobs don't give a fuck about you, so why the fuck you give a fuck about them? Then you come up in there, then they want to treat you like shit because you broke. Because if you had money, they wouldn't be treating you like shit. Got you on the clock, bossing you around. They only do it to you because you broke. And they take advantage of you being broke. And people should be smart enough to get their own motherfucking cash and work together and stop thinking these jobs is going to be your savior. Because they could fire your ass at any given moment unless you got connections in that bitch or you know somebody. But a lot of people don't got that. A lot of people is really, really are just living paycheck to paycheck and barely ain't got shit. And still be out here stunning in front of them, acting like a shit. A lot of people do think that motherfuckers got a job is way better than a person that don't. Just because of that. Just because of money. It just shows you how that's all people care about. And that's why I'm making this video. Just to let you know, man. It's, stop flexing these jobs like that. Pay attention to the person. Pay attention to if they even save or know how to save that money and try to strive for more. If you're going to work for a job, use that job to help you get more in your life. Don't be just steady working and working a job thinking you made. Because that's the setup. That's the trick, you know, because think about it. The people that own what the fuck you do work way less than you and make 10 times more than you. Just think about it. Am I lying? Am I not? You know I'm right. So why the fuck would you want to be a slave? You see them motherfuckers that's owning that bitch? They ain't got to do shit. They come in when the fuck they want to, do what the fuck they want to, fuck shit up if they want to, still get paid, and your ass slaving for them. And they treat you like shit and tax you. <laughs> Come on now, wake up. Why you thought they why you thought there's a whole a little stupid ass brainwashing agenda out here trying to teach people to hate on people that's trying to hustle? Why you think that exists? Because the people that run this shit want you to hate the people that can help and, and love the people that's fucking you. It's common sense. Wake up. Wake up, man. Stop now. Oh, it just irritates me, man. Just irritates me how, like I said, man, people really be in this dreamland. It's like they really don't see what stuff is really for. And that's why they have so many distractions out here. And that, like, you know, anything could be a distraction. But that's why so many of them out here, like sports, for example. So you don't pay attention to what things really are. So shit will just go right over your fucking head. Because you're too busy worried about a distraction. You see? And because of that, your life will continue to fall and you won't even know why. You won't even know why. Then you'll start getting mad at people who are actually trying to help you. Then you'll start running to the people that don't give a fuck about you. And you think I'm lying, okay? Alright. I know it's hard to let go. Trust me, I done been there and did this. Trust me, I know it ain't easy. But that's the thing about life. Good things do not come easy. That's why they want y'all out here clowning and buffooning like what I'm just talking about. Because it's easy to do that shit I'm talking about. That people do that got you fucked up. But it's hard to really do what it matters. You gotta let go sometimes in your life to actually have some shit, you know. Especially if what you got ain't really getting you no well. So that's how I'm in this video. Kind of want to work on some tracks, man. I ain't made a track in a while. But go ahead, though. Like this video. Comment. Subscribe. Thank y'all for all people that watch my videos. That like. I know I've been here for a while. But I'm still going. Thank y'all, man. For real. Thank y'all for all the love I get. And I'll let y'all later, man. I feel like this was a good video. Peace out.